Hey what's up guys this is Azim here and today we're gonna be unboxing and going to take an in-depth look on this Red Gear MK881 mechanical keyboard which I bought from Amazon for around 3000 rupees. It's a true mechanical keyboard with kale blue switch and it's really a great deal in this price bracket. If you want to buy this product link for that will be in the description below. So do check that out and let's not further ado and start with the unboxing. So once you'll open the Amazon packaging, you'll see the red and black box which has some detailed specification about the keyboard in the front. And at the back, the mechanism of the keys which are mechanical in nature so you'll experience a typewriter type of feedback from the keyboard which is really a satisfying feel. Now once you'll open the box, you can see the keyboard at the top, below which we have a paperwork slash manual which will also guide you about the different functions of the keyboard. At last we have a keycap remover. Now taking out the keyboard from its soft cover, you can see a really simple yet an attractive peripheral for your PC. Now talking about the quality, we have braided cable and also a golden USB connector which will ensure that this keyboard will be on your desk for a really long period of time. The build quality of this keyboard is really solid and the ease to use is also excellent with proper rubber foot trace and cable management if you like clean desk. The looks of the keyboard is also good when you'll turn it on with that satisfying key press noise of the mechanical keyboard. These all keys control the various RGB lighting effects of the keyboard. We also have some custom settings for games and productivity. Function plus num4 is for League of Legends. Function plus num5 is for FPS game. Function plus num6 is for some productive applications like Office etc. You can also assign 3 custom settings for your comfort in gaming or in any purpose. Just press function plus pd. Then function plus 1 or 2 or 3 from number pad and the select keys you want in that settings. And once you've done that, Save it by pressing function plus PD. That much for this video guys. Thanks for watching. I hope you liked the video. Like, share and subscribe. If you have any query related to the keyboard, do comment down below and I'll try to solve those queries. Thanks for watching guys. This is Azim from Skysoft Tech. For now, I'm signing out.